happy to say it's a big problem on Interstate 85 in Dinwiddie. Senior reporter Wayne Koval spoke to the sheriff's office about why your speed could mean the difference between life and death should something go wrong. vehicles are traveling way in excess of the posted speed limit, um, up in the 90s and in excess of 100 miles an hour. Well, first, where are you going? That's the question many drivers on Interstate 85 are asking themselves these days as they are being passed. If you need to get somewhere that quick, you got some issues. This past weekend, two Dinwiddie County Sheriff's deputies looking for speeders on Interstate 85 stopped six cars running more than 100 miles per hour. Saturday, 102 and 108. Uh, Sunday, uh, during the same time frame on Sunday, uh, another one, 101 and 102. I had 110 and 117. For law enforcement running radar, triple digits is becoming commonplace. 10, 15 years ago when I was running radar, um, it was rare to come in contact with somebody that was going over 100. Now, it's almost every time you're out there. Investigator Aponte says when the car running 117 miles per hour passed his SUV. Rocked my vehicle. He went by so quickly that I can feel my vehicle shift. Those running radar on the interstate say drivers don't understand they won't be able to stop if something goes wrong. Your reaction time, you just cannot react and get on the brakes and slow your vehicle down when you're going that fast uh, enough to avoid an accident. In fact, at 70 miles per hour, you're going 102 feet per second. At 100, it's 146 feet per second, which simply means at 100 miles per hour, it will take an additional 66 feet to stop with the same reaction time as 70 miles per hour. That can be the difference in life or death for you or someone else. And I appreciate that law enforcement is out, you know, enforcing that rule, right? I, I, I absolutely do. Um, yeah, I think, it's, I think it's valuable to keep people safe on the road. Dinwiddie County Sheriff's deputies say the court system is taking speeding very seriously. In fact, handing out some serious fines. In Virginia, reckless driving is up to 12 months in jail or up to a $2,500 fine.